here we have to find the maximum or minimum value of this quadratic equation by fla factoring. So first, we see that there's a common factor of negative 3. So I'm going to pull that out before I start factoring. And I'm going to have x squared plus 4x minus 5 in my brackets. Now I'm left with a simple trinomial to factor. For that simple trinomial, I see that my product is negative 5 and my sum is 4. So my two numbers then are going to be 5 and negative 1. So when I factor, make sure I keep that negative 3 outside of the brackets and then my two factors will be x plus 5 and x minus 1. So this gives me the two zeros here are going to be negative 5 and 0 and 1 and 0 to find my axis of symmetry I'm going to add the two x values and divide by 2 because the axis of symmetry is between the two and I get uh, negative 2 my maximum or minimum value occurs where the x uh, the axis of symmetry is so I need to sub in this x equals negative 2 into the original equation to find out what my y value is so my original equation was y equals negative 3 I'm going to sub in my x value of negative 2 now and here I'm going to get negative 12 plus 24 plus 15 so I get 29 for the y value at the vertex. This y value is going to be a maximum because we see here that the a value is negative for my quadratic meaning that the vertex is a maximum which is at the value of 29.